You can crop photos to remove distractions and to emphasize the subject of the photo. To crop a photo in Windows Live Photo Gallery, double-click the photo in Gallery View. The photo opens in Preview View. If the Fix pane doesn't appear, click the Fix Menu item at the top of the screen. Then click Crop Photo. A box appears over part of your photo. Everything outside the box will be deleted. To resize the crop box, position the mouse over any of the four handles in each corner of the crop box. When the mouse pointer turns into a double-headed arrow over one of the four handles, click and drag toward the middle of the box to reduce the size of the area. Click and drag away from the middle of the box to increase the size of the area. When you've selected the area you want to keep, click the Apply button. Everything outside of the box will be deleted. Click the Undo button to undo all changes and see the original exposure. Otherwise, click the Back to Gallery button in the upper left corner. Photo Gallery automatically saves your changes, replacing the original photo with the changed photo. To resize a photo in Photo Gallery, make sure you're in Gallery View. Click the right mouse button over the photo you want to resize. The Resize menu appears. Click under Select a Size for a drop-down list. Consider these options that measure the longest side, width or height, of the photo in pixels. Smaller 640 is adequate for photos you intend to attach to an email message. Small 800 is also suitable for email. Medium 1024 may be too large for an email message. Large 1280 is the largest size available and best used for printing purposes rather than email. The custom option lets you specify a size by selecting the pixel dimensions for the longest size, whether width or height. You can save the resized copy in the same folder as the original. If you want to save the resized photo in a different folder, use the Browse button to choose a new location. When you've made your selections, click the Resize and Save button. You can click Cancel to reject the changes. You can also click the question mark in the lower left corner of the dialog box to open a web page in your browser with information on resizing pictures. When you're done, Click Resize and Save.